Top 5 Facts About Samuel Beckett Amused by his birthday Samuel Beckett was born on Friday the 13th and always enjoyed the irony of being born on a date ripe with religious connotations as well as being a day of bad luck. Assisting James Joyce in his youth, Beckett spent several years in Paris helping James Joyce to write his final novel, Finnegan's Wake. Joyce was nearly blind towards the end of his life and needed Beckett's help in writing it down. Later, their friendship would sadly come to an end when Beckett rejected the advances of Joyce's daughter, who found herself smitten with the young writer. Stabbed by a Pimp in 1938, after he rejected the solicitations of a Parisian pimp, the man stabbed Beckett with a knife, causing him to need urgent medical assistance. During the police investigation, Beckett asked the man why he had stabbed him. The man simply replied, I do not know, sir. I'm sorry. Andre the Giant In 1953, Beckett built a farm in France with the help of a farmer named Boris. Boris' son was unusually large for his age and would later grow into the professional wrestler Andre the Giant. In these formative years, Beckett would drive the young Andre to school on occasion. His love of cricket Beckett had a great love and affinity for the game of cricket and played a great deal in his youth. His Wiston profile records that he played two first-class games against Northampton for the University of Dublin in 1925 and remains the only first-class cricket player to be awarded the Nobel Prize for Literature.